Hi, welcome to this He-Man re cartoon review. Ladies and gentlemen of the He-Man and the Masters of the Universe fandom. This week we are looking at the episode of uh, The Reign of the Monster. Which is season one, episode 16, I think. Let me find out. Yeah, episode 15. And, uh, The Reign of the Monster. This is the one where Skeletor gets the, uh, the, um, power stick from the bird people of Avalon, which is Stratos' uh, clan, and awakens a monster. And, uh, Stratos actually gets put under the spell of Skeletor and, uh, whatnot. And, uh, does what he's got to do, you know, does his thing. So it was pretty cool. Good episode. Um, I ranked this as a scale on a scale of one to ten. I give it a six point five. You know, but it it's an excellently written story and excellently executed. And when Skeletor does capture Stratos, he makes multiple Stratos his clone, and uh, that only can exist because, well, through the entire time, Skeletor has his, his spell on him. But uh, the girl bird person, I forget her name, uh, she actually talks to Stratos and gets him to uh, let go of, the, get out of Skeletor's spell. And due to that, the Stratos clones disappear. And uh, it was a good episode. He, Of course, He-Man and Stratos and the bird people saved the day. And uh, the, the stick is about to explode, so they get to send it into space. He made throws it into space so it could explode and come down. You know, the stick comes back down, you know, intact in one piece. All that good stuff. You know, go figure. Leave it for a cartoon, right? <laughs> but uh, it was a good episode. I like it. It was one of my favorite. It's one of my favorite episodes because, like I said, the story is actually perfectly executed as well as written. Um... He-Man shows he's actually got brain power this time by letting the female bird person save Stratos. And, uh, then the episode's over. But, uh, it was a very good episode. I remember, I'm actually glad my friend, uh, my friend actually taught me into doing this review on Wednesday. So, it's pretty cool. So, I get to go live down the journey of watching He-Man all over again. But, uh... That's it for this episode. See you in the next one.